For years now, several media outlets have been hanging on a version of the truth about the relationship between four-time NBA champion LeBron James's mother, Gloria James, and her son's former teammate, Delonte West. So join me as I walk you through how Gloria James is related to Delonte West. Gloria James NBA superstar LeBron James's mother, Gloria James, is not one out of the spotlight, as she is present at almost all of her son's achievements in the NBA and life. She was even in attendance when LeBron James surpassed Kareem Abdul-Jabbar career scoring record against the Oklahoma City Thunder to become the NBA's all-time scoring leader. But aside from being the mother of LeBron, who's Gloria James? Born Gloria Marie James on February 4, 1968, Gloria spent most of her childhood, adolescence and adulthood life in Akron, Ohio, where she also gave birth to LeBron James at the age of 16. Her mother, who helped raise LeBron, died of a sudden heart attack on a Christmas morning when she was just 19, and as a result, she had to raise a young LeBron on her own as a teenager. She, however, struggled financially and had to move 19 times as she struggled to find steady work. Luckily, she recognized early that her son needed a stable family environment, and as such, allowed a young LeBron to move in with the family of Frank Walker, a local youth football coach who introduced James to basketball when he was one years old. According to Gloria, the decision to let LeBron move in with another family was the hardest decision of her life, but it was also one of the best as she recognized that he needed stability she could not offer. She, however, got to the spotlight for the first time in 2003 during LeBron James's senior year when she gifted LeBron a Hummer H2, which cost about $50,000 for his birthday. Gloria had secured a loan for the vehicle by utilizing James's future earning power as an NBA superstar, and this action prompted an investigation by the Ohio High School Athletic Association, OHSAA, because its guidelines stated that no amateur may accept any gift valued over $100 as a reward for athletic performance. Fortunately, LeBron was cleared of any wrongdoing given that he accepted the car gift from a family member and not from an agent or an outside source. However, during the 2009-2010 NBA season, she was thrust back into the limelight. This time, not for very good reasons when unfounded rumors surfaced between her and her son's Cleveland Cavaliers teammate, Delonte West. But who exactly is Delonte West? Who exactly is Delonte West? Delonte West is a former NBA player who played in the league for eight years and two years in China. The former professional basketball player who was born July 26, 1983, was an exciting prospect as a kid as he was named Washington Post All-Met Basketball Player of the Year in high school for averaging 20.2 points, 6.5 rebounds, 3.9 assists, and 3.1 steals per game. In college, he formed what was widely regarded as the best backcourt in the country at St. Joseph's University, as he averaged 18.9 points and 6.7 assists per game, shooting 41% from three-point range as a junior, and helped the St. Joseph's Hawks to a 27-0 regular season record in the 2003-2004 season. Fortunately, he was drafted in his junior year by the Boston Celtics as their 24th pick in the 2004 NBA Draft. However, after a series of injuries and inconsistent performances, he was traded to the Seattle Supersonics after three seasons with the Celtics in a deal that saw Ray Allen move to the Celtics. After a year, he was traded to the Cleveland Cavaliers as part of a three-team trade, and in his first season with the Cavs, he started in all 26 regular season games he played, averaging 10.3 points, 4.5 assists, 3.7 rebounds, and 1.1 steals. He even had a season-high 20 points against the Boston Celtics just six days after his trade. In his second season with the Cavaliers, he formed a supporting cast for franchise player LeBron James. His third and final season with the Cavs saw him start just three games as he averaged 8.8 .8 points in 25 minutes per game. However, for some undisclosed reason, he was traded back to the Celtics just before LeBron James moved to the Miami Heat, and his return to the Celtics was controversial as he was suspended for the first 10 games of the 2010-2011 season following a guilty plea to weapons charges in Maryland. Later in December 2011, he signed with the Dallas Mavericks and was suspended indefinitely twice within the space of a month following an argument after a preseason loss. He left the NBA later that month after being released by the Mavericks. He later had a brief stint in China for two years and in Venezuela before officially retiring in 2015 after being waived by the Texas Legends after suffering a season-ending injury. Delonte West was in the headlines more frequently than you could imagine, but for what reason, you might wonder, despite his less successful NBA career. Delonte's Troubles 
Delonte life troubles got him in the spotlight more than his basketball talent. According to the former NBA player, he abused drugs, engaged in self-harm, and spent time in children's hospitals in his teenage years. Unfortunately, he was also given a bipolar disorder diagnosis in 2008, but he later denied it, saying his mental illness was caused by a mix of short-term depression and the strains of living the life of a basketball star. Unfortunately, a year later, he was pulled over for riding a three-wheeled motorcycle, leading to the police discovering three weapons strapped to his body, which got him arrested. He was, however, sentenced to electronic monitoring, unsupervised probation, 40 hours of community service, and psychological counseling after accepting a plea to the weapons and traffic offenses. His first marriage ended a year later. For someone who earned roughly $20 million in the eight years he played in the NBA, he has battled homelessness and brokenness and has been caught begging for money at intersections. More recently, he was arrested for entering a car that wasn't his and was booked on four misdemeanor charges. Luckily for him, at some point during his troubles, Mavericks owner Mark Cuban paid for his rehabilitation treatment and provided housing as well as a job. But unfortunately, he was seen begging again after a few months. But how could Delonte West suffer this much when his former teammate LeBron James is a philanthropist? Were they not close? Or are they foe? What could have possibly happened between them? Delonte West and Gloria James Scandal Delonte West and LeBron James were teammates during Delonte's two-year stint with the Cleveland Cavaliers. Delonte West was part of a quartet alongside Brazilian star Anderson Vallejo, Mo Williams, and 7'3 star Zudrinas Ugalskis, who supported LeBron. However, both players' relationships supposedly changed for the worse during the 2010 Eastern Conference semifinal game against the Boston Celtics. And the incident is believed to be the reason for LeBron's poor performance from Game 4 to Game 6 as he shot a combined 340 from the field in the final three games. It was believed that LeBron James found out his mom, Gloria James, was having an affair with Delonte West and it ruined the team's chemistry. The rumor, which caught on like wildfire, was backed by former NBA player Calvin Murphy, who said in a radio interview that his insider source in the league had informed him that the claims were accurate and that only LeBron James had been unaware of the relationship before. Delonte was quickly traded to the Boston Celtics the following season, and some sources claim that LeBron James was behind the deal because he wanted to get West out of the Cleveland Cavaliers. Sadly, Delonte West's version of events was different, and he has now revealed his own truth regarding his relationship with Gloria James. Delonte West's side of the allegation Years after the supposed incident and several rumors about it had spread, Delonte West has had to come out more than once to address the allegation. Delonte strongly denied ever having a romantic relationship with Gloria James in a 2012 interview with the Dallas Morning News, even going so far as to inquire about the source of these rumors. Delonte said, for a strong black woman like that, for people to try tear her down, that's terrible. That's terrible in so many ways. The former NBA player further attested that the allegations personally affected him because everywhere he goes, the first question was always people asking if he ever did it. Besides, he never found the humor in the question as he felt we cannot grow as a human race if we are teaching our kids to make fun of rumors that tear people down. Regardless, he has come out to give his version of the truth, but we just might never know why he was traded to the Celtics and why the Cavs team chemistry in the last three games of the 2010 Eastern Conference semifinal was non-existent. Maybe someday Gloria James might come out to put the rumors to bed. Regardless, whatever their relationship was, it can remain in the past and we hope Delonte West receives the finest best treatment. What do you think about Delonte West and Gloria James's alleged relationship? Do you believe LeBron James's performance in the 2010 playoffs was affected by the allegation made between his mother and a teammate? Let me know in the comment section.